Where did I put that copy? Alright. Okay, we have Rise. Good. Awake. Comatose. Where did I put Unleashed? Oh, here it is. I absolutely love this album. Says no one ever. How's it going, everybody? JSR Music here. Welcome back to a, I guess, a start to a brand new series, Music Rent. And what other better band to start with than the one, the only, Skillet? Oh, boy. This is going to be an interesting video. As some of you know now who have been watching this channel for a little while that I started out being vulgar on here and I kind of stopped, tried my best to stop that because I don't really like to swear on video. But this des video deserves every single fucking bit of it. So, if you don't like that, you can click off if you want. But if you, if you don't mind it, hope you do truly enjoy the video. This is going to be fun. A couple months ago, Skillet announced on their Instagram page that they're in the studio again recording for their new album. We didn't know what it was, what it was called until more recently, when they, about a couple weeks after they announced the Victorious War Tour, I believe what it's called, and God, that's cringy. I don't care. Today was the day they announced the album Victorious, coming out August 2nd, which is the follow-up album to the hot garbage pile of Unleashed. I do understand that some people do enjoy Unleashed a lot, actually. I don't. I, when it first came out, when I was still a Skillet fanboy, I loved the album. Then... Then I found real good music. Breaking Benjamin, Ben Sevenfold, Red, Three Days Grace, all those good bands. And then I realized, Skillet, what the fuck are you doing? Seriously, stop. I, I want to know, how do you go from making an album like Comatose from 2006, which happens to be one of my favorite albums of all time? I believe that my number four favorite album of all time. How do you go from that to another amazing album, Awake from 2009, which is probably their best-selling album, okay, really good album, to 2013, which was still, which is what I consider the year Skillet died when they released Rise. Rise here was the CD that started my collection, okay? And this album, I, I still love to this day. It's a really, really good album. Don't get me wrong. It's a really, really good album. But what the fuck? Three years later, we are cursed with the album Unleashed. Unleashed is jam-packed full of good instrumentation, cringy lyrics, and whoa backing vocals. Whoa, oh, bet more of those. Over 70% of the album has those. And as mentioned before, when I said that Skillet got back in the studio a couple months ago, they claimed they were getting comatose vibes from these new songs. Okay. I, I had that thought in my head. Okay, cool. Yep. This is pretty cool. I have some hope for this new album coming out soon. Maybe we can get another Awake or another Rise. Because honestly, 2006 was their prime year. And I'm like, they can't, they're can't. they past their prime. They can't make another coma show. So it's nearly impossible. So the, the slight hope I did have for this album titled Victorious now announced today was okay until when I, when I found the title I was like okay sounds like an Unleashed 2.0 basically maybe, maybe we'll have some good songs on there maybe just may, maybe a couple dear lord was I wrong I really was um 
on Billboard, I believe, they announced, or actually released their first single, Legendary. They've played three songs off this new album, coming August 2nd. Three, both, all three of them titled Dead Man Walking, being the, oh, that's the only one I enjoy. Rise Up, which is god-awful, horrible, and Legendary. Fuck that. But, seriously. I listened to Legendary three times. I liked the verses. The first listen. Half the song I enjoyed. Second listen. I got really annoyed because all I heard was Ow! Oh! 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 oh. And then crashing again. Oh, 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 oh I want to die. Still. This whole new song, Legendary, being released with Billboard for its debut is absolutely atrocious. Dear Lord, how do you go from fucking comatose... Awake and rise to fucking Unleashed, which was okay. Yeah, I don't like the album. I like, I like a total of five songs probably off the album that I come back to on a regular basis. The rest of it's absolute trash. And now we have this new album, Victorious. And it's fucking literally everything that we don't want from Skillet. Or at least I don't want from Skillet. It's literally fucking Unleashed 2.0 with more and more whoa vocals. And it's absolutely irritating because they don't even try anymore. Or it sure doesn't seem like they try anymore. It just gets to the point, I get to a point with this band that... I feel like they're just pumping out albums just because they can. And they're not putting their whole heart into it because they can make good art masterpieces. They can. This is evidence right here. And honestly, I don't care. And they, I am so disappointed with this band right now. It's to the point where... It's to the point that I don't want to be a Skillet fan anymore. I will be straight with you guys. I will be a Skillet fan probably the rest of my life. From the years 2013 and back. Unleashed was horrible. Victorious I am no longer excited for. That, that new song and teaser they put last week and the song today killed the hype for me. There's nothing left. And it's right now that I think that Skillet needs to stop and listen to their classic fans. The original fans. And listen to them. Let them put their input out there. And have Skillet write what the fans want them to. And it's to a point right now that it, everything comes down to one factor. Skillet proved me wrong. Skillet proved me wrong and give me something to be excited about in August. Give me something... That I'm not going to be like, okay, cool, Skillet album, whoa, whoa! Give me something worthwhile to buy. Worthwhile to pre-order. Worthwhile to enjoy. Simple as that. Now, I leave you with this. Should Skillet... Cancel... No, I'm, this is the wrong question. Fuck. Ah, <laughs> uh, shit. 
should Skillet put this album out, then take a couple years and listen to their fans for the next album. I want them to prove me wrong and give me something worthwhile to listen to. I really do. But, as mentioned before, it all comes to a point. Is... Are they going to do it? Are they going to make an album that actually k keeps their promise and their claims of comatose vibes? Or are they just going to make another hot garbage pile of Unleashed 2.0. And I really hope it's not that. I just... I want... I want them to be able to produce an album as good as the three I own. And I want them... To show me that they are capable of doing that again. But honestly, until the day that they can or if they can't do it, which I doubt that they can. I will pretend that 2013 was the last year for Skillet and The Rise was their last album. Because... I have zero hope for this new album, Anna Unleashed. Anyways, guys, um, I hope you have enjoyed the video. If you guys do want more of these, let me know some bands down below you want me to look into. Maybe do a rant about them. Or give me songs, too, I can rant about, too. I'm JSR Music. Keep rocking.